Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. Today we're going to review and unbox the DJI Ronin S gimbal. Now this is a new gimbal I picked up about a day or two ago. I've been doing some test shots with it. Um, so we're just going to unbox it. I'm going to do a quick review and my overall impression of having it for about two days. So let's jump straight into this. Hey guys, welcome back to a new video on the channel. My name is Jack Furley, my freelance videographer, photographer and video editor helping you with your video editing and taking your videography and video editing to the next level. I know I've been away for some time, been away for about two weeks, been building some old content for you guys, but I am back. I've been going hard on my business, I've really been getting my business up aside because I've been at university for about five months now. So I've been really getting my business up and running. If you want to follow me on Instagram, either one, personal or business, they're there, I'll put them on the screen somewhere. Anyway, so jumping straight into this DJI Ronin S review. Hey guys, for this part of the review, I'm doing a voiceover. Let me just play a quick clip of what the actual audio in the camera sounded like from here, and you can see it right there. And then if we deconstruct this real quick. We... Yeah, that was really, really nasty. So I'm just doing a quick voiceover. As you see here, I'm talking about the actual app side box, and then we start to open it up. It comes in this nice, clean white box. Got a beam battering it around. As you see here, it's like this polystyrene tough like this this box is really really tough now as we take it out here you can see the manuals in the bottom nobody reads the bloody manual anymore so you should take that out and i think i lob i think i yeet the box over and yep there we go Zoom. and then as you see here we've got this it is a really tough box so you see here i'm giving it a bit of a pounding you know i'm a six foot five alpha male and giving a bit of a pounding and if we open it up uh, we have the contents now as I said in the start I actually took the DJI the gimbal out because I had to do a shoot on the following day that I got this so I'm just going to take it apart quickly and show you where everything goes so I think I reach for the yep there you go that's where the um, cables are so you've got your cables you've got a bit of the that follow focus so you can attach to the side of it there's that you can attach to follow focus and it comes with the ring as well, I think that's a replacement for something, I'm not sure what that replacement for, but you've got that, and then you've got an Allen key in that little thing there, then I put it back away, now I'm unscrewing the actual gimbal itself, that is an extension tripod, so that's an extra extension grip, but it also turns into a tripod, which is very good, so you can just put your gimbal down, and it's like a little tripod, but you need that thing, most gimbals have charge extra for that, but it actually comes in the Ronin 2, which is very good, so you know, Weebly might charge extra for it, it actually comes with the gimbal. And then this thing, the main grip is actually the battery. The battery lasts for about 12 hours and it's about two hour charge, solid battery. You are not gonna run out of battery with that battery. And then that's where it is in the box. I kind of took it out, I can remember where it went, so I think it's there. No, nope, it doesn't go there, Jack. Yeah, it goes there, Jack, leave it alone. <laughs> Um, and the way you turn it on is by that little button that's at the bottom of the um, gimbal itself. And then here is the actual gimbal itself, the motors and the stabilizers. And then here I'm just showing you the actual joystick. There's a joystick and if the, you can see in the, there, what I'm pointing to right there, it's got a little M on it. Yep, there right there, that is the user mode. So you've got three, you can't see because of the light too bright, but you, there's three modes on it. Um, you've got mode one, you can like set up a custom mode like really fast and you've got, you basically got three user settings that you can use um, in the DJI app and you can set it up. As you see here, this is the full tripod with the extension on it. Um, as you see right there, I'm trying to turn it on and then it turns on and then it does a bit of a spaz out I think. Yeah, it starts to spaz out a little bit. I get a little bit tired so I turn it off. Uh, got a little bit scared of me, so I turn it off, and then you can see it, you can power it off without powering it off. It just puts the motor to sleep, which is very good. And then you can balance it or do whatever you gotta do. Really, it's a solid gimbal. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's been a quick unboxing and review. The DJI is a good, good gimbal, but the only one complaint I've got is that it is quite heavy. You now, once you start adding accessories on, you start um, adding, I don't know, a couple of like LED plates. It starts to get quite heavy that's the only thing that i've got an issue with but that could be an advantage as well because of that you are getting some really nice buttery smooth um, images but apart from that i've got no complaints at all the test footage that i've done is fantastic the 360 roll that you can do the infinite roll amazing solid test on that and the battery lasts for 12 hours that is a solid amount of time for a battery anyway guys i'll have another video up next week of me reviewing the dji after i've been on the shoot because i'm filming a club tomorrow 
I'm going to do some behind the scenes. I'm going to get some uh, test footage for you guys. So if you like, if you want to stay tuned for next week when I have a proper review of it, I've had it for about a week or so for a review it. Uh, on, a, on a shoot, stay tuned, and if you like what you see here, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications every time I upload a, every time I upload a new video. And if you want to help support the channel and creation of future content, go buy me coffee. The link in the description. Anyway, guys, I'll see you on the next video.